All right, today we're gonna to take a look at another one of Smith & Wesson's heavy lug 357 revolvers. This particular model ran up until 1999 when it was discontinued, and after about a 12 year hiatus, Smith & Wesson decided to bring it back in the classic series. We're gonna look at the original Smith & Wesson 586. Another wheel gun Wednesday coming right up. First, I want to thank Michael for stopping by the shop and dropping off this pair of 4 inch and 6 inch 586 no dash revolvers for this review. Michael, thank you very much. The Smith & Wesson 586 was introduced in 1980 and it ran until 1999. The 586 was offered in several different variations and quite a few commemorative models were also released. The Smith & Wesson 586 was built on what it calls its L-frame, which the company defines on its website as a strong, durable frame and barrel built for continuous magnum usage. So. Heavy loads, feel free to bang them. I just want to point out that the two 586 examples that we have today that Michael dropped off for us have had some custom work done. So the trigger and the hammer will not look like a factory gun that you may see in your local gun shop. As I mentioned before, the 586 was discontinued in 1991, but after a 13 year absence, Smith & Wesson reintroduced the 586 in 2012. It is currently produced in a four inch and a six in the new Smith & Wesson Classic Series. Now the downside. The suggested retail for the 586 is about what you would expect to pay for one of the originals. All right, there you go. Quick look at the Smith & Wesson 586. If you want one of the originals, you have to look at a gun shop or check online for auctions. However, the new classic series are available. Thanks for watching another episode of Wheel Gun Wednesdays. Make sure you like, share, favorite, and subscribe. Also, let us know in the comment section if there's anything that you would like to see us shoot, or if you have something you'd like to bring by the shop, feel free. We'll try to get it in as soon as we can. Thanks again.